Coming up on Sunday night with Megan Kelly, for the first time, six women who are entrepreneurs talk about alleged sexual harassment in Silicon Valley. Host Megan Kelly joins us live with a preview. And Megan, good to see you. Why did these women decide to come forward and talk about this now? Well, you know, it's fascinating to me because San Francisco, Silicon Valley, it's supposed to be the most progressive place in the nation. They pride themselves on owning their progressive values, what have you. But there's a cesspool happening out there that they have not yet dealt with. And one by one, more and more women are, come, are popping their heads up to say, me too, me too, me too. And it takes a lot of guts because the situation out there is it's very dominated by men. You know, the, the men have the money, the venture capitalists and the entrepreneurs try to get the money from them to fund their startup businesses, including a lot of women. So the nature of the relationship is, you know, unbalanced when it comes to power. And what we're learning more and more as these women speak up which has only been happening for two weeks, right? The scandal, there was one woman who came forward a few months ago, then nothing, um, is that this relationship has been exploited time and time again in egregious ways. And I think when your viewers see these six women sitting down and they're not whiners, they're not complainers, they're just sort of matter of fact saying, yep, this is what I deal with, yep, yep, yep. They'll understand you know, why things have to change, not just for those women, but for a lot of women who experience this in other businesses as well. And when our viewers tune in Sunday night, what will surprise them the most about this story? You know, I would say how, what, what a toll it takes uh, on women who go through it. It, my number one takeaway was not only do these women, so, you know, it's not easy to start a business in Silicon Valley, especially as a woman where the numbers are very low and women leave Silicon Valley at twice the rate as the men, you know, because it's so hard um, and what they go through. But these women are talking about, you know, they had to, they had to dress to make themselves look androgynous so they don't get hit on at every meeting. Mm -hmm. They have to do these meetings late at night over a bar with some guy trying to stick his tongue down their throats. Mm. Uh, on top of all that, they're trying to get a company off the ground and manage employees and sales and so on. And so there was this quote about, you know, how uh, Ginger Rogers had to do everything Fred Astaire did except backwards and in heels. Hmm. So the Atlantic had some quote about how that's what, you know, these women have to do backwards and in heels. But then someone's tag tugging at your dress and somebody's asking you to take a break from dancing and go get the coffee. <laughs> so that needs to change. And these women will talk openly about it for the first time. Well, I mean, it's something else because it's sort of that, you know, uh, non-talked about subject out there. So thank you so much, Megan Kelly, for joining us. You bet. Megan, thanks so much. And be sure to watch Sunday night with Megan Kelly at 6 o'clock this Sunday right here on Channel 2. Interesting.